What's up guys, Justin Davis, I'm back with a brand new video, really bad gamer, we're going to be rocking out on some Baldur's Gate today, maybe play an hour or so, uh, the new Baldur's Gate 3 has uh, released early access, now before we play this guys, um, for any of you guys that know me, I love Dungeons and Dragons, and I'm a big fan of Divinity, um, the game, Divinity. So, uh, Larian Studios has made this game right here, ah, Baldur's Gate 3. And uh, it is, of course, based on D&D, uh, &D, you know, Baldur's Gate, and Sword Coast, and all that. So, we're really excited to see what happens. However, guys, I want to point something out. We're about a year from the actual release of the game. Uh, this is the early access. We are expecting bugs. There are going to be more classes, and there are going to be more races uh, once um, uh, the game actually releases the actual full game, not just uh, early access. But we are excited to try this, guys. We're fully expecting to see some bugs and some errors and stuff like that, but we're going to try to jump into it anyways. We're really excited about it. We know this game is going to be good. And, uh, yeah, I'm super excited. I don't know if I need to create a profile or a new game. I'm going to go to create a new profile because I think I may have to do that. New profile name. Um, I'm going to go with, hmm, let's go with Rotter Bronzebeard. Perfect. Brought a bronze beard, so this is one of my uh, my favorite names as far as with RPGs. So brought a bronze beard. We're gonna accept that. Accept. Okay, here we go. We did have to make the name, so we're gonna go to a new game. I want to try to be quiet during some of the cutscenes, guys. So. Turn away now. <laughs> cinematic who are you who am i oh man okay so this is gonna be the uh the whole game here um the whole hour i'm gonna use so okay from what i have heard i didn't want to go into this knowing too much but i wanted to know a little bit so i know that these are uh these are some of the characters that you will eventually be able to pick. <clears throat> They're not available right now. But um, it's characters that have are basically pre-built characters. So they have a storyline to them. Uh, different people react to them in different ways and things like that. So I am, if anyone knows me, I am definitely not playing an L. 
that is is not gonna happen. So yeah. Uh-uh. Not gonna happen. Let's check out the Oh, okay, we need this. Okay, I need a name. You know what I'm gonna go with here? Broader? Bronzebeard. If I didn't name myself Broader Bronzebeard, uh, something would be wrong. So uh, I feel like we really need to figure out what we're gonna play before we pick our background. So let's go to race. So this is your elf. By the way, like I said, this game looks freaking beautiful right now. Looks really good. Tiefling. Uh, I don't want to be a female, so I know there is a way to change that. So elves actually don't look as bad as I thought they would. Most elves are just super light. Uh, even the the male elves are usually very feminine. But uh, this is this is good. I I can take that. I can take that. That that's not bad. Not bad. And of course you have. Ooh, he's ugly. Anyways, um, but still, he looks like a man. That's good. So you have high elves, wood elves, tieflings. You have the Asmodeus tiefling. You have the Mephistopheles tiefling, which looks awesome. And you have the... Oh, oh, man. That's cool. So as you see, you get your strength bonus, your charisma. For being a tiefling, of course, you're plus two. But, um, plus one to intelligence, so maybe if you're planning on going wizard or something like that maybe you'd want to go this guy right here so a pretty cool drow loth swarm drow which are the evil drow and then from what i've heard these are actually not evil drow but i, I could be wrong but the loth swarm are absolutely evil they don't look too different this one may be a little more blue yeah anyways humans uh, you're, you know, you're just a human. Um, yeah. Um, as a human, of course, you do get a plug. Gosh. Oh, my goodness. Uh, base racial speed. Uh, plus one to everything. So, okay. Uh, get Yankee. Uh, my question is, I wonder if they're going to add get the Sarai eventually in this. But uh, get Yankee. They're pretty cool. I do like uh, Githyanki. So, uh, Githzerai, if I'm not mistaken, are the ones that are more uh, along the wisdom. And right here, this is going to be where I go today, guys. Um, pretty sure. Wow! The beard looks great! His face looks great! Like, the red hair and everything, that's kind of how my guy's going to look. Look at those big old hands, man. I love dwarves. Okay, I'm freaking stoked. Constitution plus two, Dwarven Resilience, Battle Axe, Paper Hand Axe, Light Hammer, War Hammer, Dark Vision, that's always good. Uh, dwarven Toughness, okay, yep, so my uh, speed will be a little uh, less, actually. If I, you know, I want to be a Dwarf, I'm going to have a 25 speed, not a 30. And a plus one to Wisdom, that's as the Gold Dwarves. The shield dwarves, of course, are a little more hardy. They're more of your, your fighters. Which I'm thinking about maybe going... Oh, gosh, I don't know. Maybe going cleric. I, I'm pretty sure I'm going to go cleric. I mean, my name for the longest time was Morgan Cleric. So it makes sense, right? And we can just kind of see how it goes. I'm definitely going to dwarf. But we'll uh, check out half elves. I, wow. See, this is actually a little more of what I expect elves to look like. Uh, see, he's just got softer features. <clears throat> it's kind of what I was expecting. Uh, wood half elf. Okay, I can see that he's a little slender, but he's got a more masculine face there. Um, drow half elf. That's that's really cool. Like they don't have that in any of the books, I don't think. So they're gonna have to like figure that out. And then halflings! Freaking basically hobbits. Uh, yeah. Halflings. Uh, Lightfoot and, of course, uh, Strongheart. I always thought Stoneheart. What's wrong? So, yeah. 
A legend says the Orb of Blood gave strong hearts their hardiness. Orbs are the best. <laughs> okay, so we're gonna go with um Ah, uh, I'm gonna be honest, if I'm going cleric, I might as well get that wisdom. You know, that's gonna help me, so <clears throat> and the likelihood the spells will land. So yeah, we'll go with Gold Dwarf, which I think they're going to be a little darker skinned. See, he's a little more pale. Um, but I'm going to make him lighter skinned because I'm super pale. And, uh, yeah. So, <laughs> perfect. Okay, race. Okay, if I'm going cleric, inside and religion proficiency. That would probably be the way to go. <clears throat> I'm going to play this guy as a hero. You know? Um I bet they're gonna add more backgrounds too. Like these seem like the basic ones from the player's handbook. So Less worn here. That is a female Recent voice. Hells. Well, Something. A tidy slot. The stone's less worn here. Hells. A tidy slot, but no rune. Mm. The stones. Hells. Something just woke up down here. Yeah, let's go. A tidy slot, but the stone's less worn. Hells. Something oh. just woke up down here. Yeah. I guess uh, that one will do. Oh no! Oh, I forgot. The stone's less worn here. Re Hells. A tidy slot, but the stones are less. Hells. Something just woke up down here. Okay. Um, base. I I'm gonna be honest. I really like that word base. It's all super serious. And uh, oh, that one's cool too. It's like a, a dwarven. Pat Sajak. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Um, he looks a little happier, you know. I don't I don't want that. I want I want my guy to look kind of serious. Not that serious. <laughs> um oh man. But I don't want him to seem that old right yet. So let's go here. You don't seem too old. We're gonna oh wow. We're gonna pell him up. I mean, to be honest, guys, that is about my skin. <laughs> okay, yeah, he's uh, a little more pale. Uh, I like, I like that the beard doesn't look fake. Like, it looks like they really tried to make the beard look nice, and I appreciate that. Um, I really, really appreciate that. Okay, so most of my characters, I always go with um, the green eyes uh, and red hair. They uh. This clan is from my Dawnshire game, and um, their clan is called Bronzebeard, and all of them have like this dark red beard, so. That's kind of cool. The hair looks good. I'm really, really happy about it. I like that! That's kind of cool. It's kind of tied back a little bit. I'm not a big fan of that, but I kind of like it. That's a little much. No such thing as an emo dwarf. There could be. You could make one. I mean, technically, I guess there is. I mean, playing D&D, &D, there's everything. 
maybe I'll play, I'll play kind of, that's my hairstyle. This is me, except I'm not four foot something, and I'm, I'm not muscular, I'm just fat. <laughs> okay, sorry. I actually uh, think you go with that haircut. Yeah. Okay. So you do see the beard kind of going in there. They may fix that, may not. But that's one thing that I've, I've always uh, looked at. Come on! You no! You can stop it. No. Dwarves need beards. Big, bushy beards, okay? I'm actually going to go with this one uh, because it don't sink into the chest. Uh, maybe they'll fix that. Maybe they won't. I'm, I'm not. That is... Okay, see, that's kind of the color I usually go with. Um, we'll check out the... Oh, that's actually not bad. Uh, like the... That's good. I like that a lot. <clears throat> I like it a lot. Um, tattoos. I doubt I'll put any tattoos unless it really comes up like a chip drop or something, you know? Yeah. Oh, we almost had a chip drop. Yeah. Oh, you can zoom in. What's it say? Look. Hair looks good. It hurts. Whoa! It's like, that's weird. Wow, look at the detail on the face, guys. That's really cool. Oh, no! <laughs> Did not mean to do that. I thought I was changing the color of the tattoo. My bad. No. That's pretty cool. Gotta be honest. I are a fan of that. I don't normally go for stuff like this. Gosh, it looks kind of cool. Yeah, let's let's go with that. You know, he's got he's got this tattoo on his face. It's kind of back up some. See how it looks from farther up. I don't like it from farther up. Like up close, when his face is super detailed and awesome. I mean, he's beautiful. That's that's. Man, gosh, those eyes, really lifelike, really impressed by the detail there. Okay, um, we're not, okay. Yeah, we won't do any, oh crap, we won't do any. Okay. Regular old stuff right? Um, <laughs> yeah, you don't need makeup. We're good there. Okay, so, got that there. His face, let's see how it looks. And of course, they could add even more customization later on. We don't know. We'll find out. Okay, class. We are going to go cleric. I would imagine cleric, fighter, rogue, warlock, and wizard would all be good classes. The ranger, if it's made like the actual game, would probably be the weakest class in the game. Uh, I love rangers. I love Rangers in Dungeons and Dragons 3.5, but I, I feel like they really lost, they lost me um, in 5th edition. Yeah, we're going to go Cleric, guys. I really want to go Cleric, Life, Light, and Trickery. Life is uh, in, uh, an aspect of many good deities offering spells that protect and restore the mind, body, and soul. These are healing clerics. I don't want to be a healing cleric. Spells that dispel darkness and comfort the young man. Uh, yeah, I kind of want to be like that holy cleric. Okay, so of course, I don't think. Saloon, Shard, Tempest. Watcher is an eternal century of the god, representing guardians across the plains. After more than a century of fading worship, Helm's power was restored with the second century. 
So you would have to look up D&D lore to understand the sundering and everything. I don't have 17 hours to go into it. But, um, yeah, I'll probably go with Helm. Uh, kill him more. Uh, but that's, you yeah. know. Moradin! Mmm! The Allhammer is the Dwarven God, worshipped by Smith, artisan, and miners alike. Hmm. Moradin could be a good one. Some of these, I feel like I haven't seen them. that name. Oh. The tires, that's cool. Uh, but I'm gonna have to go with more of it. Let's, let's, whoa, did, did the cantrips change? Guidance, resistance, sacred plane. I guess that's because this is, oh, I get to pick. I get to pick my cantrips! Freaking sweet! Okay. Resistance. Magically uh, bolsters a character's defense. It receives a D4 bonus to save the bonus. Sacred Flame! Guidance. It's those guidance upon a creature. I see it's like a okay. Um, so the only other one I have is the Um, so I think I'm going to go with prepared spells. So, um, uh, saying create water. I'd like Bane, which I already got it. Uh, command. Command's nice. Command. Moving or taking action. Hmm. Create water. I wonder how that works. A couple of brain distinctions. Oh, that's going to be super important in this. Guiding bold. Perfect. Killing word. Oh, Dang it, guys. Oh, man. I just know that Create Water is going to like Divinity. It's going to rain and cover the, the ground in water, and then you'll be able to, like, get rid of fire and stuff like that. And, you know, later on, light it on with electricity and stuff. So, but I really want the healing word, to be honest. No, not that one. Dang it, man. This is really difficult for me. Sorry, guys. I'm not trying to take forever. I'm just, uh, I'm going to get rid of Bane, and I'm going to put in Healing Bird. Uh, just in case. It isn't much. It's 1d4. I don't know how much hit points we start with. I'm guessing we're level one, so I'll probably have about 10 or so, I'd imagine. 10, 10, oh my gosh. Did you look at that crap? What the heck? Last week, spell slots unlocked. Wisdom, saving throw proficiency. Charisma, saving throw proficiency. Light armor. These are the spells that I know, okay? I just do not have them prepared. Um, 
always going to be good to have. So, uh, those are the skills. Skills without proficiency, all those. <laughs> okay, abilities. <clears throat> okay. Uh, I don't know the skills. Okay, that shows the skills that go with it. Cool, okay. So, can I... Yeah, have to... Okay, uh... Okay, so I'm guessing this is like a point by system. <clears throat> okay, so I'm definitely going wow, okay. It's like no more on this. So I can take some away. Uh yeah, uh I will be wearing heavy armor, so my dexterity, I'm not worried about. I'll make that my dump stat. Um, prison storm, constitution, I do need a piece of constitution. This actually doesn't seem too bad to me. My wisdom is my highest. And then...
tiny The stone's less worn here. Recently uncovered. <laughs> that beard! Okay, sorry. I'm sorry. He he is gonna have that. And it's gonna be the black one because that's cool. Black. I like it a lot. And he's gonna be a. Um, he's gonna be a. Sh no! Okay. You know what? I'm just gonna leave it. Finishing up everything. This is really weird. Whatever I'm supposed to do here. There's no like start. Okay. He was waiting a long time.
studios had to go through. Because if they're going to destroy part of this city, which I'm sure is a prominent city, um, in the Sword Coast, and as you see, stuff's getting completely destroyed. stuck inside if we hadn't been attacked. This is the pool that thing came from. The parasite now writhing behind your eye. Hmm. Hi right, guys, our first roll. Let's investigate. Notice nothing more than meets the eye. Aww. Dude, dude. Um, I'm not, I don't think I want to reach toward that pool, I'm going to be honest. For one, it's on fire. Um, they just, my character don't think that would be very intelligent. I would much rather Someone walk. Someone else got out. Someone else got out. So, like, I wish I could, like, walk around with this. Like, I can just kind of look at it. I get it. Restoration. Oh, it's a 
In the hells? We are trapped. Images oh. of goblins, their habits and histories flash into your mind. Help us. I don't want to help y'all. I do not want to help y'all. Now, uh, something that I am noticing is I can't seem to rotate my my camera. So I would definitely want to because I cannot see over there. Like I yeah I can do this. Who's saying? Okay, camera rotate left. Delete and end. So, uh, I'm gonna just, the thing is, I know when I change it, it's going like this way. Guys, the intellect devourer is gonna come out and they're gonna kill me. Like y'all say, we are Nick. Here. Here. Oh, 
That's an intellect devourer, bruh. Yes. You've come to save us from this place. From this place you'll free us. Please. Before they return! Deception failed. They return. I think you're best one saving. A newborn. Born new from this husk. You know no creature like this. One that is more brain than person. I kind of feel like I should destroy it. rush past, a dragon's wing, a silver sword, and a flash of your face seen through the strange woman's eyes. Oh, my head. What is this? Squaw, you are no thrall. Flakith blesses me this day. Together, we might survive. Okay. Imps block the path forward. Got a companion, you will assist like. me in destroying them. We must reach the helm before we transform. Oh, wonderful. I don't want to transform. Uh, but my character don't know that, so transform. We what can mind flay of parasites. Unless we escape, unless we are cleansed, our bodies and minds will be tainted and twisted. Within days, we will be geek. Mind flayers. I'll, I'll say oh, my the guy would be like, okay, Then we find know. the helm and take oh, control. That's cool, man. She looks awesome. We will address the matter of a cure for this Super infection cool once we reach the material plane. Beautiful. Here is the leather. This should teach me combat for the most part. Um, yep. okay. uh, a roll of the die besides turn order. This is called initiative. So and is influenced by your dexterity, which mine is a negative one. So this person actually got less than me. Because I literally take a negative one. Well, probably. A one since your available actions are out. Bonus actions. Bonus actions are actions you can perform on top of your normal actions. And then mo move 
movement bar, right? So mine will be shorter than your average because I'm shorter, stubby legs. Okay, so I'm um And it seems like it did some good damage, so... Intended. Okay, cool. So, I really do move. Nothing! I kind of want to get a little closer to the action. Maybe not too close. Maybe, uh... I wonder if I can... Oh, 
Well, maybe why, I would imagine. So, like, I could say shove, but I don't, I don't think it's going to do it. Hey! Okay, learn a little bit. Okay, um... This thing sucks. exactly know how they work. Um, so, yeah, I'm not sure. Let's see where it says nine there. Oh, that must be the button. I gotta use. Hmm. Now that is good. So, if I use this, what happens? I'm just gonna use my game. Yeah. I would, I would Taking a look, you know, everywhere, guys. 
it off here soon. Okay, so well, walking through here, I guess we just got to attack this. I guess. Yeah. Time for stragglers. The construction is too alien. Nothing looks familiar. This ship is crashing. Do you intend to die for a stranger? Roll. Come on. Yes. Warding runes. The pod won't open unless they're destroyed. Satisfied? We need to go. No! Wait! Sorry. Life flickers in his eyes, but he seems totally unaware of his surroundings. Thank you. 
trapped inside the pod. Jeez. She doesn't notice you. inside do as I say Oh, 
guess I can heal myself a little bit because I could have used it. Take you. Five. Four. Okay, that's decent. Happy about that. Spell slots. Okay, so I can't give that to her. Back to the bolsters of creature defense. Uh, and saving through is really isn't going to do anything. Uh, fire bolt is not going to do much either, I would imagine. So we'll just um, walk up as far as we can. That's all I can do right there. Wings look awesome. That's a cool picture. Really, really cool. Nice. Yeah, that's definitely her. So that's going to be one of our, our buddies, I think. You may be able to play as her, actually. I'm not sure. Like, she may be one of the ones you get to pick. Like, she might be. I'm not sure, but you definitely can't play as him. <laughs> oh, that's cool. She's awesome. 
She looks bad butt, man. Love those ears. Well, then. Ah, oh, he's a warlock. I bet that's his patron. That's, uh, I know that one guy uh, with the uh, succubus. His ear. ship, I'm guessing. The water looks, like I said, the water looks great. Mm. Oh, my friend's gone. Mangled Fisher. Sure, I'll take her gold. That's maybe terrible, but... I don't see nothing wrong with it. He is dead, and I, to be honest, I'm sure he would want me to help. I wish I could at least like po Oh now it's letting me just hold it. See I prefer that. saved guys um it is uh it is unfortunately about that time that i need to get off so with that being said what do you think so far we got it first that first little part getting off the uh mind flare ship and essentially crashing it i guess um seems pretty cool uh, got to really figure out so I don't know I guess I had taken my long rest now spell slot finish so um, yeah I only have two spell slots so when I use that first level spell that is essentially it I have two first level spells and then they're gone I, I don't have them then I'll just have to rely on Sacred Flame, which was doing pretty good, if I do say so myself. I wonder if I can just, uh, attack fire. Well, I did four damage, and, good lord, <laughs> the barrel exploded. Anyways, guys, we hope you enjoyed the game. I'm going to save it. We will start back here for the next video. Thank you guys for watching. I appreciate it. Really excited about this game, guys. Diving into it even far, uh, farther. Uh, well, yeah, even further, guys, and uh, really getting into the storyline. Uh, I thought it was a cool introduction. The game looks nice. 
Uh, the sounds are good. Uh, there's a few things that kind of was a little off-putting. Um, like the, the fire from the dragon when he blew his fire into the ship that one time it looked a little funky um but that's something easily they can fix um yeah uh there wasn't a whole lot that i really saw so far i'm sure there'll be things but um uh, yep. there it is. i just wanted to <laughs> um i would show you all these other awesome ones really great guys um really liking it so far i think it's going to be a great game can't wait to explore more of it with you guys so uh guys if you liked this video if you um want to go a little further into this journey with uh, a really bad gamer um or as my son would call me um uh rb gamer i'm rb gamer now that's really bad gamer dab on them that's what my son said so uh, yeah so if you enjoyed it um if uh you want to continue on this quest with uh uh dear mr broader bronze beard then uh yeah uh hit that notification bell so you can uh, be notified when uh another video comes out so thank you guys for tuning in i really appreciate it guys take it easy have a great day and to all my fellow gamers, much love. See you guys later. Peace!